what can I say guys back from Vegas I know you guys are gonna say I'm the bad omen I'm the bad omen I mean how we've lost today uh, I will not know well I say I will not know we I do know how because like some fans have said it today it seemed like we had half an eye on Wembley you know yes as fans we can look at the table and see those West Brom players at the foot of it all but relegated and, and think to win three or four nil but it looked like the players thought that today as well you know and yes we had a lot of pace on the bench we had Martial on the bench we had Rashford on the bench and Lingard and you're thinking I'll tell you what mm, I don't know about that we should be attacking these we should be attacking these lot and we was just absolutely clueless that it was like the Man United of, of the mid-season when we were up and down in performance no creativity no dynamic runs no sharpness on the ball it just went from bad to worse and the worst thing about the performance is you can't even say that West Brom didn't deserve it you know they stacked up they made it difficult for us to beat them difficult to, for us to break them down which we must have expected which we must have expected I'm very reluctant to blame Reno for that performance if I'm deadly honest with you I think the players really got to stand up and, and, and say we weren't good enough today yeah tactically maybe he could have gone a little bit more attacking wise I understand that but the players that we put on the pitch were good enough to beat a team that only won three games before now um, all season and that's how I see it I'm, I'm so disappointed it just looks like they, the players just thought they can turn up and roll West Brom over. And it, it's embarrassing today. It really was embarrassing. We were going sideways. We were playing slow. There was nobody taking any risks. To be fair to Jose, he tried to change it very early on. Herrera came off at halftime and Lingard came on. Maybe it's easy to say Lingard should have started, but we should have had that creativity from the off. Um, he tried to impact change early on. Um, Martial came on shortly after and it just didn't work. West Brom were, were so difficult to break down and, you know, another set piece another set piece we know what West Brom are like we, they've got big units they've got big players are going to come up threats in the air and like a fan said in the fan cam earlier on we, we would have had all week to prepare for this all week and I can't help but think that the players have just thought I tell you what guys we stopped City from winning it um, we're in the semi-finals of the FA Cup next week uh, we'll, we'll brush these aside 3 or 4-0 and like I said it's okay for us fans to think that but as, as professional footballers they need, they need to show up. They need to show up. I, can't, I know you guys are going to be in the comments saying, Flex, stay in Vegas. Should have stayed in Vegas. And I get that. I, I wish I should have. <laughs> I probably should have. You know, I've, brought, I've brought rain. It's cold. Um, and a bad result. And I'm, so, I'm sorry about that, guys. But um, I don't think any of us expected this. I'm, uh, a tweet I put out before the game about predictions. People were predicting 6-0. It's fours, fives and sixes. How, how wrong we were today. But um, look, we were always going to give the title to City. Um, Technically, if you ask me, it was better to lose this um, than lose at the Etihad. I understand that in front of their fans. But losing against West Brom like that in that manner, it was just so poor. And the worst thing today, it didn't even look like we were going to win the game. Uh, you know, it didn't even look like we were going to score. And that's the, that's the thing. But I don't want to dwell too much on that. You know, yes, we're fine for second place and we need the points. I understand that. But the big game, it all lies on that semi-final. You know, after seeing Spurs lose in the manner they did against City, I was very confident. I was looking at it thinking, I tell you what, if we go and attack Spurs, we've got a very good chance. With this performance, uh, I'm a little less confident. But can we go and get the win against Spurs? Of course we can. All we've got to do is obviously not concede in the first 10 seconds, not make silly mistakes. But of course we can. Why not? It wouldn't be uncharacteristic of us considering the season we've had up and down to actually go to Spurs and, and, and do them over so I really hope we do um, I really hope we do because we need something to salvage this season because I tell you what with Liverpool in the semi-finals of the Champions League City have just obviously won the league today if we don't win that FA Cup we're looking at a really bleak season and you know Liverpool are, are chasing us for second as well so that's, that's it for me guys really disappointed I don't think we could any I don't think any of us would have seen that coming today um I don't really know what else to say, really. But don't crucify me too much. It's not my fault. Yes, maybe I should have stayed in Vegas, but I had to come back sometime. But on to next week, guys. I'll see you then. Thanks for watching.